We have a lot of things going on today. We're prepping for a trade show at Metal Forum in Atlanta. We also have a new installation coming up at Bloomers in Valencia. And we're heading over to the factory in Shanghai for some press inspections. It's just another day in the office at Sutherland. I love the metal forming trade shows because not only do we get a chance to meet some of our customers face to face when we don't go over to their plants, but it gives us a chance to meet with our distributors, service providers, and give the competitors a hard time. It's personal. Our name's on the product. When problems occur, we need to be the first responders to make the problem go away. We take a great pride and passion in doing that. Okay, my name is Jody Flutterman. I'm the president and CEO of Batesville 2 and I. So I believe we have seven Sutherland presses, ranging from 100 ton to 400 ton. Okay, I'm Craig Arnold. Uh, I work for Townsend Design in Bakersfield, California. We're an orthotic manufacturer specializing in knee braces. We've used Sutherland presses for about half our equipment in Mexico. We just purchased uh, earlier this year a Sutherland press. We found the service to be very good. We've had a good relationship. If there is an issue or a problem, they've addressed that right away. We've had a very successful outcome. The motivation behind Sutherland Presses is to bring the best solutions that we can that can be cost effective so people can continue to innovate and create for a number of different fields. So Jill, the purpose of this meeting is? We need to review the new installation at Bloomers in Valencia. When is that taking place, Edgar? Two or three weeks can be ready to go. I'm here today in Valencia, California at Bloomers Metal Stamping. Bloomers is a high quality stamping company and we were fortunate enough to meet up with the owners of Bloomers, Perry and Matt, at the Atlanta Metal Forum Show. And the result of that is now two 66-ton presses uh, installed at Bloomers, the newest additions, and they come with the new iPress control. I like the thought of working directly with a, a, a president or owner, and he's hands-on and he's involved, and we just kind of liked, liked his approach, basically. Really impressed with how they came in. They seem well-built, they seem pretty heavy-duty. We're happy with the way they look and we're anxious to put them through the paces. John Nicole. Hi, John Nicole. It's Sandra with Sutherland. How are you? Okay, how are you? Good, good. You have Jill Sutherland and I here. We want to say thank you for your order. Great, you look very nice. The service is professional. This is the beginning of a long cooperation with Sutherland. Hey Mark. Hey Hector, how you doing? I'm just checking up with you on your trip to uh, meeting at the factory. Yep, ready to go. Okay, I'm I'm two days behind you. I'll see you there. All right, bye. Let's go inspect some presses. Team and I have just landed in Shanghai. We're on our way to our various factories. Uh, we've got a very good week ahead of us. We've got about 25, 30 machines being prepared for shipment, and we're here for final inspection and some of the customer runoffs. So Ningbo Technology Park has a lot to offer. We have the capacity to make presses from 1,200 tons and below, mechanical or hydraulic. And why have we settled into the Ningbo area? Other market competitors are in the same industrial park, so we're able to use some of the same resources. It's very dense as far as industry. And also here in Ningbo, a very strategic location outside of Shanghai has a large harbor for big crane capacity. So it allows us to go from packing to port within a number of days. People that work within the company are your biggest asset. It's not the typewriter, it's not the computer that's brand new, it's the people in your company. So let's bring the best people that we can, the most experienced that we can, so that we're all motivated to do better and make a difference, because we all want to make a difference.